Hi, in this video, I am going to show you how we can make template parties on admin side. So you see, this is our index page, it means our design page. And you see, uh, last time we created one page, uh, I think we didn't create it. So let me create one page. I am going to create here, page name is demo.php. So we are going to make partition on this page. We will keep safe this index.html. So later on, if you want to use something from here, then we can use. So let me copy this everything from index.html and I am going to paste. So you see, I paste everything inside this demo.php. Now let me run here demo.php. So you see, we got everything. Now we have to clean here. Like you see, we don't need this notification, this email icon. So we have to find out it. So let me start. Okay, so we have to find that first. Mm, five, so let me find five. Oh yeah, drop down notification. So let me select this. I'm going to clean. Yeah, now we have to remove this email. So let me select this drop down for message. Select this DAV and remove this. You already have this template. I already provide the link of this template in description. So you can download from previous videos link. Okay. Now we don't want this icon. So we have to find this flat one. Okay, let me check. No, still it's not removed. So we have to find out. Yeah, this one. Not that. Where is it? Okay, this is the admin night one, so we don't need to delete it. Sometimes you see if you want to find then you can press Ctrl C type means your inspector is open then click here and we are going to find it. Where is it? I class flag icon. Okay, so let me find here yeah, this one flag icon and we can delete it. So you can inspect from your browser also. You see now it was gone. Now in menu right now we are going to use this dashboard and other menus we are going to remove it when we need we will edit so right now we are going to keep only dashboard so for menu i am going to come components so from here our menu start so i am going to delete this deleted i am going to select this also deleted deleted now let's check what is the position you see menus are deleted so let me delete more delete yeah okay so now let me check so here you see we keep here one menu and then now we need to clean this all this success message this part we want to clear because here our data is coming drop so we are going to delete these things so you successfully read this from here it start so let me first delete this let's check yeah it's deleted you have to delete from div to div so this div deleted this div deleted okay now let's check what is the position yeah still some data are there so you have to remove these
Okay, now let's check again. Yeah, still some remains. So we have to delete it. Yeah, this new customer. Okay, check again. Okay, only two things are remaining. Since we this is deleted and this deleted. Okay, let me clear these things. Okay, now let's check what is the situation. Yeah, it's perfect. Now let me write something here. Okay, you see, we are getting our data at proper place, and this is for heading this for that from so we can keep this also so if you are going to check then these are our content area these are our content area so let me set here content area then copy let me delete this one and paste it okay so you see before whatever data is available table content area means copy that all so i am going to copy from here everything on table side i just cut it here i am going to add new page page name is header.php and i am going to paste here and this header.php i am going to include here in demo.php include header.php now from here i am going to cut these things and i am going to create one new page page name is footer just paste in footer.php and that page i am going to include include .php. now let me run yeah now uh, you have some questions in mind why we make this type of partition what is the use of this partition now you see we made partition and now you are going to create some more pages like you added 50 pages on your admin panel and if you want to change something like if you want to change menu in 50 page then what you have to do you have to just change that menu name only in this header.php if you didn't make partition then you have to open each and every page and you have to change at each and every page so that is not good idea because later on if you have to change then you have to do more exercise but in this case only you have to change at one places that's why we made partition of template thank you so much for watching my video if you like my video then please like it and share it. Thank you so much again.